here we go. It's time for some more bonus door action. We got we got uh, the the head the head commander there biodegradable. I had nothing to do with it. We got Sandwich. Look, Thesis. it says field research. By bio, by... It says right there. Thesis. You made. I am Sandwich. Wilster Wonkles and Snacks a lot of there here as well. Nice. Oh, right. Yeah. Hi. We're gonna yeah, play this cool. crazy we'll contraption you set up there, Bio. Lines. Lines. Will Will Wilster Lottles here. <laughs> this is the floor is lava by uh, Astro X. And it's oh, like... this one. Are you familiar with this one? Oh shit. Yeah, well, it's well, kind of hard to forget this one because there's no sector. Oh, this is a one sector map. If you guys are familiar with that, when you have a one sector map, then these guys don't get mad at you. Does that mean that the uh, doors don't go anywhere? No, they're exactly. just like on the wall. They're just like painted on. It's like fake. Yeah. Nothing's real. Yeah. So I was right. If anybody Bears played the can't ten open doors sector this. megawatt. So it does. Wouldn't wouldn't that disqualify this map? Nope, because it's bonus door. Yeah, we're a little more uh, lenient when it comes to bonus door. But but the whole point is that you approve this map bio. You you said it was good. No. I don't approve. The, the, the fucking thing disqualifies because there's no Baron opening a door. That's the entire fucking point. Bio, stop throwing your project leader weight around here. There's Barons and there's doors in it. <laughs> there's door textures. That map should be disqualified. Exactly. <laughs> you have no power anymore. That's the entire fucking point. Oh, don't touch those. Yeah, the, the floors kill you, right? Yeah. Who made this one? So the point so is just the map just has to have a baron and a door. Astro Except the door can just be a texture. If for, fu for bonus Astro door and final door, apparently. Then how is a baron door? It's not a baron door. Baron door is the first one. But how is it a bonus if it's not baron door? There's not more <laughs> baron door. The bonus door. How does the fucking door qualify if all the doors were painted on? It's bullshit. It had barons, it had doors. I mean, you know. Close enough, right? I paint doors all over my house. That way, home intruders will not be able to figure out where to go. This is kind of. I have one that's so starved to death. Yeah, wait, wait, who am I fucking thinking? Of course, I told you what I do in case of home intruders. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> so it's funny because there's two, there's two floor is lava type maps next to each other. Yeah, the fucking Except this lava is insta death. I wish I remembered who made this. Like, so find out after. I can look it up. Oh, cool. Shit. This is kind of like an awkward way to fight revenants. Oh crap! You can't walk in the. You'll get dead if you walk in the. You like those revenants? I'm oh, revving yeah. some ants right now. What uh, what map is this? <laughs> 21. The Sky's Lava by Hernik Bazooka. Yes! Sneezy oh, McSneeze face. <laughs> before this, the one before this is The Floor is Lava by Astro X. So we've covered everything with lava in this quad. Did anybody do the walls or lava? No, I guess we didn't do that. We did one where the doors are lava. We did one where the doors weren't doors at all. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, I think in this one. You, apparently, bonus door, you have no fucking standards, so I don't even yeah. have to use a door! We, we, <laughs> we, we already explained there's no standards. Wait to see what's going on in Final Door. In <laughs> <laughs> Final Door, there's just psych, there's no fucking door at all. It just degrades further and further into like absolute nonsense. It's kind of awesome. To be fair, it, the whole thing started, it is a joke that just went too far, so this isn't yeah, a joke. I guess I need. My submission for the original <laughs> Baron Door was nonsense. I liked it. Did I'm so happy I survived it? it too, by the way. If you're talking about 27. Yeah. Yeah. I liked your the Baron one Door I, maps. The one I made in 45 minutes while I was both drunk and high. Hey, remember I that one was fine. Sandwich? What? Do you remember what I do? Oh, do I shoot uh, the thing? I wonder if they changed anything about this. Maybe get the Baron Probably to open not. the door, like like the title of the, the project. Oh my god. <laughs> it's just a hunch. Oh wait, this is this bonus door, never mind. 
No, this whole pumpkin. area is like anything could happen. This whole area is like switch hell. I remember if, this area. If nothing's from changed. Play it. It's convoluted. Yeah, because I couldn't figure out what to do. So, none of these doors open. Oh, wait, what does this one do? Some of them are hit. Huh. Wait, when you touch the skybox on the floor, like you instantaneously die. Yes. Okay. Just like real life. I mean, if there was a this like, one where I think look... you have to hit those three switches in order, the back, and then go up the ramp in the other room. Oh. This God. thing was like, this thing got fucky. There's three doors there. Those are some girthy doors. Usually you only go like 16 wide. And... Yep. It's not <laughs> fast enough. Even if you know what you're doing, this is like... And what's the Baron's gun? You don't, you don't fucking... Sandwich, I thought there was a you... way to get in there. Oh, yeah, there you go. Switch. So... Sandwich, so how can you defend them from this the back in 7 first. hours shooting on Doom 64? Should I hit the back first, you say? If you're comparing Doom 64 to Final Door, you've already lost. Or Bonus Door. No, no, all three of them. Well, Don't evade the question. Why do you need three of them to lower a thing? That doesn't make any sense. Only one of them should lower the thing. To keep all the, no, to keep all the so doors the open. The tactic won't work here. Yeah, strong What was man. your... What was your... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know what those other buttons are doing, but... They keep those doors open, so you can do that. I'm very glad I got some health going. What was your stupid question? Who? How can you defend this to spend seven hours shooting on Doom 64? <laughs> I'm, def I'm not defending this. I'm saying this is a this is a water you're, you're getting, you're just getting it. Uh, sandwich. That's a straw man. Yeah. <laughs> it's I'm strawmaning my own argument that I just made. <laughs> yeah. You're getting Don't... infinitely less gulpy at this than you did at Doom 64. Therefore, you clearly defend this and think I'm it's an acceptable it. crack mapping practice. And keep in mind, I'm trying to avoid the skies the whole time because the skies will fucking. Also, the walls. The walls are lava in this, actually, technically. Well, it's actually the floor. No, I mean, there's a hallway there where that has um, invisible walls that. Could that revenant be in a more annoying right place? Right there. Well, revenants. the walls can't kill you. It has to be the floor or ceiling. <laughs> yeah, sure. Isn't no, there that's a one-player bump flag in UDMF though? Like if you walk into a line def and that activates it. Oh, I didn't remember that bonus door is in UDMF. My bad. Well, what, wait, what format is it in? Huh. It, limit this removing. is limit removing. Oh, okay. Well, I didn't know that. Well, now you do. Okay. So you can stop being wrong now. Except Final Door but, also I don't feel has like a map man with gun that breaks in limit removing, so you have to play it in boom. It's too fucking elaborate, yeah. Like, uh, I, yeah, I, I actually tried loading it with the comp level 2, and it just, like, had the invisible monster problem or whatever. The ghost monster problem, I think. Something weird like that. These kind of look like no. walls and they kill you, but you're that, it's technically the floor. That's a crusher in Resurrecting Issue. I thought it was an issue with the nodes that he had, where, like, you couldn't oh. hit monsters in certain parts. I just died. Oh, well, for some reason, um, after a little time, a bunch of monsters, I could clip right through them, and I couldn't pick up any ammo. If a monster so, gets know. crushed, and then it gets resurrected, it'll go through no, walls. No, I thought there was something that happens that, like, fucks up all the monsters. I couldn't hit them. What? It was weird. Uh, just just run, just run uh, Man With Guns uh, in, in Satanity. Run it in comp level 2 and, like... Uh... I don't like, play I'm Doom maps. Not... Oh, damn it. Right. You got those fucking sidewalls <laughs> up. Okay. Could be worse. Is there any more friggin' cells? Are there more rockets? I want cells. Oh, fuck. Alright. Note to self. I, don't, I uh... feel like they don't walk so fast around here. I feel like they play this MIDI at Guantanamo Bay, not gonna lie. I can't hear it right now. Is it, is it that bad? It it starts fine, but it just... It descends into... I, I don't know. 
I feel like if you listen to it for several hours, you'd probably lose your mind. You could probably say that with a few midis. Yeah. Probably say that with a lot of music. Open I, up. I disagree. Like the, hot, I think... like the red hot chili peppers. Yeah, that would that would not take hours. I would lose my mind. <laughs> that, no, that, no, they literally use that those songs. All right, sky's lava. That's that's done. That I was barren this way. Good Wait, this how many maps are you planning to play tonight? An hour's worth. We'll see if I'm back. Which last time was like two. Is this, <clears throat> this is by um, Knife World? I don't know. Uh, I was buried this way by evil scientists. Evil, right, evil scientists. She remembered that. Oh, shit. Nice Lady Gaga midi. <laughs> Lady um. Gaga. <laughs> what? What? Hmm? Huh? <laughs> what? I'm on the door track, baby. I'm a bear in this way. <laughs> Can you let me get the guns or what? The fact that you know that song well enough to create a Doom parody on the spot is very concerning. <laughs> I think we're done. Just kill those guys. This song's alright. I heard Actually, no, I'm not a big fan of this one. Is that your favorite grunge song? Yeah. You play that for. All of the hot grunge gals that you invite over. <laughs> it's kind of an oxymoron. I feel like a Are there grunge, grunge gals probably... anymore? <laughs> Heart just, attack. Like, I know this one. Like, the anarchy made it. Disgusting people on the planet. It's kind of an oxymoron to say that. I don't know. Apparently, my mom was into grunge in the 90s. Yeah, I don't think they're around anymore. Are you having sex with my mom? <laughs> yeah, sorry. <laughs> No need to apologize. I didn't really want it to come out like this. These hearts are freaky when they scream. Yeah, what are they screaming with? Um... Do they have a mouth? It's the escape of air as they contract every time they feel pain. You know, we this is so random, these maps. Me. Some of them are crazy, but like, there's clever, clever stuff going on here. Yeah, there's very uh, yeah. clever use of having barons not open doors. Well, the barons are actually Wait, triggering the doors by killing the commander Keens. They're shooting the. That's the premise. It's can a you, baron can opening you just a door. Shoot the heart yourself, though. Well, you don't have enough bullets, I don't think. Oh, okay. I don't know how much health a, one of those things has. You could take out a few, but barely take... any. I'll try to do it you the way it's uh... intended. Oh crap! It's like it's like a pirate, pirate rock. Pirate rock? That's a real genre. It probably sounds more. like this. Right up there with grunge. Or this is like... This is like that Viking metal. Ugh. Yeah, I agree. That's my reaction when I hear the phrase Viking metal. Yeah, this sounds more Viking than piratey. Yo-ho-ho. -ho, and a battle axe. Really? Because it sounded like it was doing the whole da 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 Was it? Commander Keen has a hundred hit points. And how many bullets do you 40 hit? more than an M. Oh shit, there's another well, one. Well, I think I did this level by shooting them all. Cheater. Um, yeah, you could yeah. kill all of them with 50 pistol shots. Oh, there's five, never mind. Maybe. Is there a bit of RNG needed though? I don't know. Well, you can also just punch cheater. them. Can you? Oh, you can reach them? Probably. Okay. There we go. And it gives you the option to rocket them if you want. I'm not sure how I would do that. I'll go up here and get the rockets. I'm surprised the blood doesn't burn you. That'd be too bad. I'm used to playing Wilster Wonka's map, so the blood always burns you. This map is cold. Your blood maps. Maps burn it. I'm used to playing your Baron Door maps that are usually pretty ruthless about that. I like making Ryan the blood is... not damage the player because I like putting it everywhere. 
I wish they had a waterfall texture in original Doom textures. I still can't believe they don't. Yeah, that's really weird. That's like the only thing. Like, if I had to have one thing added for a texture to Doom 2, that's like the most important thing. Oh Doom my god, remember this one, Bio? Right hmm? You're still awake, remember what? this one? You press the buttons and you do the thing? Oh yeah, gu guide the Baron around. Yeah, yeah where's the Baron? One. He's at the start. You've okay, so yes, yeah, so you open um, him up. And just, you know, alert him. Oh man, I get to play this myself. Get the barrel. This is one of my favorites. Way, huh? You gotta be careful not to kill him along the way, too. So, no. firstly, you open him up. Oh crap. And then you raise the bridge. And then he opens you up. <laughs> oh yeah, we got a lot of money. You can kind of deal with all this. Like. You can kind of deal with all this stuff first, but. You know, I feel like this level should like have him walking at the beginning or something to give you more. But I think Dubium wanted to be uh, more casual. Seriously, hats off to Dubium because this is fantastic stuff. Yeah. Take a look around for a second. If I owned a hat, I would take it off Dubium. So take that as you will. If I was wearing a hat, I would take it off. I own a hat. I, I don't. Oh yeah, You're the Baron's also trying to kill bear, me. That's Barry right. is shooting you. Got stuck on the switch. It's, it's really quite rude that you're helping him out and he's just kind of shooting at you. I mean, you're not really helping him out because he gets crushed at the you end. You know those like dog shows where like you get your dog and you get him to run through all these obstacles and stuff? Or horses? Or yeah, I was watching animal. that a couple weeks ago. The, this is like the, that, but with a bear. Yeah. yeah. I like it when Zoidberg went through that on the Futurama. <laughs> it's like, hi, I'm Zoidberg. I'm going to do this now. And then he did it. Bender was angry. As Bender always is. Very Seriously? miserable man. Seriously, man, Dubium has some clever ideas. Sometimes he goes a little too Oop. far with that, um, walk, take your Baron for a walk forever. <laughs> but this is a, an interesting concept that's just enough of itself to, like, you know. Yeah. Okay. You have to get him through the zigzaggy obstacle thing. And then what? Is that, yeah, you, wait, wait, did you hit the switch? Oh, yeah, right. Does that go. raise them? <laughs> there he goes. Yeah, you would have had a hard time getting through without that. And everything is temporary, so... Yeah, it is. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't mean to get all deep I don't like there. the way you said that. Oh man, here comes a Mancubus. You think this is, uh, oh yeah, you... Fucked. Hopefully this doesn't... This. Why isn't there a woman cubit? <laughs> I don't want to know what that would look like. A woman cubit? I'm gonna give the Mancubus some big ass hits and then I'm gonna show you what it looks like. This button's That's... already lit. It's I'm... likely already been I... done. I think I'm all set, thank you. Uh, so this is the best part. This is the part that I'm worried about really badly. This is the most dangerous part of the course. Move it. Uh, now, the Zoidberg uh -oh. got what it takes. He got him right in the shoulder. So I think what we figured out is maybe get a little further away from him and maybe he'll fire at you a bit less. Uh, kind of not, not in that direction though. You want him to be moving. Hey, I got him one way in. Yeah. I get what you're saying. Yeah. All right, and then... Uh, you think barons have to go through this before, like, getting deployed? Oh, man, into I am so map. much better than you at baron walking. Uh -oh. <laughs> yeah, I don't think barons that. get any training, considering they have the combat equivalent of an imp, just with a little bit more damage. Some of those imps, man, they take three punches, berserk punches. What about an archvile, though? Well, you have to yeah. you get to beat them longer. Wow, they're so tough. <laughs> That's the secret, is like. Hey, Doom wait a minute, you fucker! Him. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing, Barry? Where are you going, bud? Oh, motherfucking Barry! Oh wow, you timed that well. Yeah, sometimes he kind of starts walking in the opposite direction. You fuck you off, might... guy. He kind of. 
How is this on? Does that. How is this happening? This is exactly what happened to me last time. I actually didn't expect him to like go backwards, and then these guys are shooting at that. Me. That Baron needs a therapist. He's just fucking just wandering to the crusher. He's like, every but what about time. the crushers? I think that you know is doing all right for himself. He'll figure it out, and if he doesn't, he's got the crusher. Okay, good. We got him over here. I think we got her. Does he open the red door for me, I take it? Where's the... I guess? <laughs> I remember being able uh -oh. to sequence break a level in Doom the way it did because of something like that. Oh shit, I soft locked myself. Nice. I guess that's a thing you can do. There's no toaster bath for this one. <laughs> that big loaf of toast that that guy was baking. Is that Zolkar S? Ah, uh, that was Doob. Oh yeah, the Zolkar S one was, um, the toast. Yeah. Just like a barren ass by Knife World. Hey, we're getting through these ones. Oh yeah, this is you can't like bump the bear and ass or else they wake up, eh? And then oh, they also like open the earth files. So this is like anti bear and door. You have to not wake them up by carefully making sure you're completely between them. And I bumped one. And I might want to walk. Up. And then at the end, a big scary face pops up. Should I not? Should I not run? You want to walk? I can do this while running. Wait a minute. Why is that guy there? <laughs> How do you contend with that shit? Don't worry about him. Don't worry about him. Oh, he's stuck there. Okay. Well, that was considerate. Oh. That's very precise. not considerate. That was brutal. Oh my god. Just hold shift to walk. God, I don't want to walk. Would <laughs> you rather... <laughs> okay. Walk, don't run. You'd rather just tap the run button hitting? and keep losing? I, th I, think, I think you're not allowed to touch the sides. Yeah, you yeah, have to stay as to middle as you can. But it's extremely, like, precise. It is. In, in places. In places it seems almost like it's more... Oh, fuck, and I saved there. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I want to have to take it slow. <laughs> Are you safe scumming Barrendor? I've been safe scumming Barrendor. The only way. Yeah, that's fair. Have you guys not seen an off time press level... save button? Take a look at the top left of the screen. <laughs> oh my god, yeah, that's this is the, like watching the a secret is we just speed run. People just don't notice he's saving all the time. They're like, wow, he plays everything saveless. <laughs> Amazing. Step save, step save, step you save. Put the step black save. bar along that whole column of the screen. I wish there was a way to hide it so people could see like how much I don't trust myself and how often I'm pressing that shit. <laughs> it is like a million times make easier a walking. You're right. Wait, did they get crushed yeah. or? I almost got it. Don't tell me I woke them just at the end there. Yep. Shit. Oh my uh... god. So you can't, you can't, you can't, you have to not wake them up back. Man, I'm still. Do you want to? Do you want to know uh, a tip? Yeah, give me a tip. I wonder There's what that a secret like. behind that key. Type in I D C L I T. That's, That's the secret one potion. You got a potion. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm so glad you were here for that. <laughs> Oh shit. Yeah, yeah, so for some reason this area feels very specifically hard. Well, you gotta have your gun out because like I like I mentioned before, I, I find that if you line up your gun with the center, you can really keep yourself centered. I'm gonna save that as a backup so I don't have to reload the whole thing again if I botch save it. Alright. Wow, look at that. Like, exactly that. Wait, I'm not... That's brutal. It's tricky. But I don't think I have much to do other than just go back. 
And then this fucking archbow. I guess I punch him out now with my berserk. You can do that. Did I not get a berserk? You did. He, bump he bumped me up to these fucking guys. Okay, What's that worked the pain out chance on an arch file? Low. Okay, that's, that's helpful. Doesn't it have like the lowest pain chance? Uh, it's either that or the cyber demon. <laughs> Listen to all the debag files being crushed. By the way, I have a new map. Oh, is that out, what like, that sound is? I have a new map coming out like late tomorrow night, and it's gonna have debag files in it. Nice. The bagels. Oh, fuck. The file. Actually, there's no arch file, so it's not as urgent now, maybe. What's that? What's what? What? Hello? Damn it. Yes. Oh, you could've. Why am I hitting them? You sound like someone that worked at Subway. Who? So I'm still Walk not us. clear on uh, on what you meant when you said that explains a lot. This is a bitch. <laughs> Mind uh, you know, expanding your thoughts on that topic or? No. Oh my fox. I thought he came off more as like a A and W type. Who am I bumping? Let the quote stand like, for itself. Those were like the shittiest stories I have like ever told in my life. Oh my gosh, I cannot get by. Yeah, here. we know. It's like, holy hell! I thought it was kind of funny. Yeah, that's because you have a shit sense of humor. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, who? Sandwich or me? Sandwich. I like your jokes sometimes. What yeah, the shit? Thanks. <laughs> I didn't remember that one. <laughs> I'm genuinely surprised. I'll have you know you laughed when I said quarterback. <laughs> no. Yeah. <laughs> no. You could bring up video evidence to the contrary. Do you laugh it's every time we talk no, about no, it's, it's sucking Georgia's tongue? Like sense of humor's good? No, I don't. You did for a while, then. Yeah, there's, there's absolutely nothing funny about Jar Jar's luxurious salt-wedged tongue. Exactly. I'm not the one that brings it up. Yeah, that would be absurd. Well, this didn't go right. Also, absolutely nothing funny about shitting and coming at the same time. Yeah, absolutely not. Yeah. It's just, it's honestly a, a concerning medical condition to be doing those two things at the same time. And where, like, wait, is, is that where whenever you shit you come or whenever so you So about the game shit. we're playing, you guys. Uh, yeah, I, you know, I'm, I'm still on the Freudian anal phase of pleasure and it just feels so damn good every time. Yeah. Can we stick to the topic though, for real? Nice arch file jump. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm yeah. doing here. Speed runner. Uh, I like all of the pain elementals in formation. <laughs> just, just ready. Oh yeah, this is pretty nifty. Nifty. Uh, I, yeah, this level's actually really cool. Uh, some really awesome lighting. What's who's this by again? Worried idiot. <laughs> Worried idiot? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's a nice name. What's he worrying about? It can't be the fact that he's an idiot. He, he knows that much. <laughs> Yeah, 
It is a bold name to have. Confident. Yeah, but it's stylistically I mean, designed to be that way. <laughs> like, how, how do you how do you get an argument online and people are just like, you're a... How do you... Yeah, how do you win an argument when your name is Worried Idiot? Yeah, that's what I mean. Least confident name. Uh, so... This BFG is gonna be... Useful. It's gonna be FG. You might want to... Oh shit, yeah. this is happening now. Holy fucking This shit. is happening now. Oh crap. This is your life now. You live here. Oh, look at the monster counter. Oh! Keep going up. Ow! Ow! Isn't there a limit on Ow! how many lock holes can be in the Yeah, I don't think I have mine turned on. This is gonna get bad. I just gotta get out of here, dude. It's not usually turned on with limit removing. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> Alright, we got out of that shit situation. <laughs> bread. We called it bread. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, I recognize this one. This is by Valhan. Uh. And I don't think we ever luck. figured out how to really beat this. Get good? It's, it's, it's got simple in the title. You I don't just understand remember what the numbers. numbers mean. You just remember. You just memorize them. I don't understand how knowing these numbers is gonna help exactly. It fucking doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> is that the joke? It's kind of fun. It's I kind do. of funny that it's there though, because it's like it's like you really expect someone to remember. Damn. Like, so you can't let the barons get to the end or else that. Yeah. Yeah, I would. Uh, uh, is there is there video evidence of somebody beating this level? Uh, I remember like... Rebo beat it and may have posted a demo of it, but I don't really watch. I've watched like two demos in my life. This isn't like this makes Sunless look easy. Yeah, sandwich. When you played this, you did not finish this. I remember you. No, kind of no. After a while. Like a the, while. Is because... this the easier version? Why the fuck? Did yes, you make it apparently. There? Because the the harder the original version of Maribo couldn't beat, and she's can beat some crazy stuff. So apparently this is beatable for Maribo, but I'm not that good. Uh, I mean, I I this might be beatable for me if I did a lot of grinding, but maybe not. It might be too late for me. I think I'm gonna bear and get too there close. There are some less fights that felt a lot easier than this. Uh, even so with safe scumming, is... because that's what I'm doing. You know, I'm safe scum the safe scum. Yeah, even doing that, it's hard. Like, this would be a bit fairer if instead of barons it was hell knight, but with barons this is really mean. And you know, it's not hell knight door now, is it? And the barons on the sides there actually resurrect with arch files. This is actually a good example of what I mean by like hell knights are superior, and more fun to fight than fucking barons. Yeah. I'll try to save scum one more time, but there's a harder version of Final Door that I'm not even going to touch. I'm just going to say that right now. Yeah, I don't even know if it's beatable by humans. <laughs> Maybe. Fuck. Like, the, the creator of this map has beaten this level, right? Uh... So, what's... I'm not sure. Ouch. Maybe. And, like, the numbers make no sense. I mean, like, the numbers make no sense. Two, it's six, uh, you don't you don't have enough four, resources one. because uh, if you concentrate on getting the barons, you start rocket splashing yourself, or you get hit from the sides from barons that that resurrect. Um, so I think what it, it, it what it, it really is a memorization. Like if you know if you remember exactly like the map, and you remember exactly where every baron comes in. Well, maybe so it's far it's two six three. Why do they like go the, the fuck four. back there? But I, this could actually be interesting toned down, as it I'm is. I'm trying to change the direction of this guy, but... Uh, there's also RNG where sometimes they just walk the other way, like that. Yeah, and it's like, if you have to hit him with six rockets, like, if it was just Hell Knight, that'd be a lot more consistent with, like, um, how quickly they go down and everything, but... Yeah, three rockets. 
Yeah, this is nonsense, man. These are, the, yeah, yeah. The, I feel like they also, what, like, what's the Hell Knights or uh, Baron spread, like, five to seven or something? Like, there's just no so you don't, way. You don't necessarily know. Yeah, this, this level broke me, dude. I can't believe this is the toned down version. Like, this is nuts. <laughs> I fucking try this because I, I don't know. I, I remember watching Sandwich Bank and thinking, I do not want anything to do with it. But it looks like something that's just, it just stares you in the face. It's like, I need to defeat you. It it, it feels so doable until Great. you try it for a while and you realize you get chipped down yeah, so yeah. easily, so constantly yeah, but, that is there it's any actually. Any healing items in there? And no, and also they keep coming. Like, like. How many, they just how many keep... Baron? Is there a lot. Like, any? Okay. This guy's like 40? Oh, God. 30 or 40? Like, co considering there's like maybe 10 arch files back there, and there's maybe, what, six barons on the sides. So the rest of them are coming in as a drip feed. And what's funny is, like, the beginning's easier. Uh, and then later on, you get like two that spawn, like, next, like, at the same time. Like this. But are the are they in lanes together or are they like spread across multiple? They're lanes? spread. Look, look right there. See, there's one in the but first. You can't and even one like the... hit one and splash damage the other. You and can't alternate splash them both two. either. You oh, have to be my legs hitting hot. both. Of them. Whoever laid this out is psychotic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's evil. It's it's evil because it also feels like well I'll just like if you just fire on the barons right away how hard should it be but it's hard. Oh man, I'm starting to really feel this like map right now. Try one more time with some very you're, you're... careful saves. Yeah, you're not gonna. I I think I remember with God mode it was hard because you still have to stop them from getting there. Oh yeah, Good Lord make any sense to leave my square, does it? Wait, they don't come in the same order every time. It was 2631, but this time it was 2643. Yeah, the numbers loading to saves. Alright, is he loading saves? I thought they were No, consistent. he restarted the level. Yeah, I restarted a few times, trying to find the right fucking RNG life for right here. Okay, yeah, I, I wasn't even sure if it was random. I wasn't even paying attention to the numbers, because it didn't seem to help. I guess, I don't know, monster teleports, you can time them Damn. Um, under these compatibility settings, but it's not so I don't know if exact. I have a good save or not. Probably not. No, that nope. fucker. Is there, is there a good save on this level? Nope. Oh, I feel like man. you have to be firing each one perfectly from the beginning. If you get, if you get backed up at all, you're, de you're already dead. Son of a whore. I do like the fire blue sky, though. And so does the YouTube compression. And they have the, the gall to put simple in the title of the map. Yeah, it, this feels like kind of a troll job. It's kind of that funny. Flap in the face. This should be map 32. It's the, the ultra secret level. This should be map like no maps for this one. You want this god dang thing out of there? Honestly, play this with god mode and beat it. I, I consider that beating it. Well, let me give this a few more hard. tries. It's still hard, dude. <laughs> I can imagine. The worst part is, like, there's no fucking room for this rocket launcher business, even if you had a plasma gun. Yep. Yeah, you, what, you splash what yourself really there easy. faster, though? Rocket launcher, if you're hitting them all, or a plasma gun? Suck my... Ooh. Which piece of shit? Oh, man, that was... Hold on, let me reload that one. You got the guys on the side, and this guy... Oh, I gotta get them both. They move, like, deceptively fast, eh? Like, you wouldn't think that they could fucking get there so fast, but before you know it, like, you're out yeah, of you're room. Hitting, you're hitting them with rockets, too, and it doesn't seem to be slowing them down at all. No. You can't miss any. Fuck. 
They also teleport slightly before you expect. It's like they don't necessarily. It's like in, slightly in front of the line, in front of the door. They teleport in. They don't open the door. Oh, this is psychotic, like you said. Yeah. So you actually have less time than you than. I feel like this is a hopeless scenario right here. This guy. Oh man. Everybody has to. Fit, with I guess everybody trying to fight Nom. I try to warn people, but you have to figure it out for yourself just how hopeless it is. <laughs> This is like so frustrating. Man. Yeah. This is supposed to be the easy version too, and that really pisses me off that this is still like impossible. Well, like I said, like Maribo beat it, and it's like, yeah, I'm not near that good. <laughs> This all, this seems very like 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 kind of a speedrunner type joke level. What was the name of that one megawatt you opened up the uh, one stream? Yeah, this would be all, like, like that Rocky uh, 32 maps dot wad joke wad where it's like a bunch of speedrunner jokes. Like this actually feels like that. Damn it! Where it seems like they're composing levels based off of what is theoretically possible and not of what is humanly possible. Uh, I think they're all possible, but it, it requires people who are, who, you know, play or in the incredible human. amount of the game to, to grind out small advantages, right? Like, so, oh, man, like, this is smart. not only are you good at the game, but you spend a lot of time just grinding one level, getting the completely optimal route, you know? That's the people that are inhuman. Like. <laughs> Something that no mortal man shall challenge. Sort of. Stuff, panic I, would like, I would like to know if the designer of this level beat it themselves before releasing it to other people to play. I Hopefully think I get they may not have... I think they did. Uh, nah. But also, someone did beat it, so it is possible. I feel like, yeah, like this is just... No, like you've already lost at this point, most likely. Yeah. It's so infuriating because, like you say, like it seems like you should be able to do it. Notice they actually teleport on the numbers, basically. So it's you have less time than you think. <laughs> See? They teleport before they get to the rockets. Not they don't open the door. Oh yeah, 3% health, that's gonna be awesome. Look at them just coming like crazy. Ugh. Like rat. Yeah, do god mode. I'm trying to, if I can get my keyboard I honestly to work. Consider that, I honestly consider that beating it, because it's still hard. Yeah, I would like to see like a much easier version, because you got the harder version of Final Door, but you gotta give like an easier version, man. Because this is still retarded, no offense. <laughs> so like, notice how much splash you're taking even on god mode. Oh my god, I still like, can't fucking do anything on god mode. You still can't- yeah, see? Fuck it. <laughs> it's amazing. Next one. No, seriously, like, that's too annoying, man. Even god mode is hard. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, well, I got a choice now. This weekend, I can either go to the lake and spend time with family, or I can uh, grind this level and try to beat it. Yeah, like, who has the time for that shit? People. Calling sick for the rest of your fucking life. You're playing fucking map 26. Like that made yeah, me mad. Isn't it map like, 27? Seriously. Oh, I rec I remember this one. Yeah, yeah, this level. 
This is a long one. This is a really long one. This would be my last yeah. one then. Is this Baronic Space Elevator? Yeah. yeah. I recognize the opening room. All right, guys, strap in. I'm finishing it off with I'm this one. Buckled in. Yeah, you've. Mar I'm you are. Still buckled in from Snacks' story earlier. Where is Snacks? Don't know. Snacks left, didn't even notice. Shit. I was so busy, like, trying to shoot barons in a fucking. <laughs> Is that a I'm fucking... eating. I'm oh. eating hummus. Wait, what's hummus? It's this goop that when you eat it, it makes you hum really loud and obnoxiously. That's why she muted her microphone. No, it's the pita chips that are loud. Yeah, it makes you go hummina, <laughs> hummina, hummina. <laughs> Oh yeah, is there no music in this one? Who it is again? This is a silent level. Hummus is like a, a, a dip that's made out of uh, chickpeas. And there there's a, I mean there are a couple of moments where the silence I think works. I did recommend them put in at least a, a like a couple moments. Wait, you told me that mini. my levels were all good. But uh, what? What? <sighs> He said that there are only a couple moments for his silence work. <laughs> I think I made a joke exactly like that when you played this on live stream. Yeah. Because you mentioned that it was silent, and I said, do I need to sue? This is a big elevator, by the way. It goes up, or does it? Yeah, I only chimed in near the end of the stream last time, so I don't know most of this map. Let's go. Oh my god, look at that. I'm gonna take a shit over remember back. There's, this... <laughs> there's a toilet in this level that will live in infamy. Oh, hello. Yeah, Zalka RS is doing some like super ambitious stuff here. Levels like this, though, that for me just feel a bit long, and I personally probably would not enjoy them very much past a certain point. Welcome to Woo Cafe. The Yu Woo Cafe. So the use of Woo Woo things makes me question its sanity. Oh. Yeah, I would recommend. Are... Sorry. What? Sorry, what was saying? You gonna finish your sentence or? What sentence? You said, yeah, Uwu cafes are, and then you just stop. That's not what I said. So just, what did you say? Uwu cafes are. No, I said... I don't remember what I was going to say, actually. Never mind. <laughs> I, I would recommend just Very running past a lot of stuff, because there's... You have a shotgun. You get you actually get a super shotgun on this floor. So you can come back and deal with that parent if you want. Are we, am I coming back to this? Am I coming back to this spot? Oh yeah, because you're riding this elevator up, don't you know? I'm riding this elevator a few times. Oh yeah. All right, Each then floor, I'll come baby. back. I'll come back, and kill them later. Yeah. Um, yeah. Fucker. At least you get the super shotgun on the first floor. Oh. I, I remember like because like... I, I freaking. I, I had the normal shotgun for so long, and when I got it, I was just like rapturous with joy. Rapturous, he says. I like the uh, red rock curtains there. Yeah, those yeah there's nice. some cool. Uh, those are those are meat curtains. Shit. Someone a lot yeah, that baron you told curtains. me to just leave alone came back and got me. Well, you can shock you let him. him astray. I think I just pushed through. This fucking guy chased what? me down and got me. Yeah, you might as well. Oh my Everybody's God, favorite elemental. rock texture. Like vanilla texture or any texture? 
You can't answer Blood Jungle. That's the only stipulation I'll give. Okay, there's a in O text. There's this really good rock texture that tiles very nicely, and I'm gonna pick that one, whatever it's called. Very descriptive answer. Yeah, shut Thank the fuck you. up. Your service. You're welcome. Oh, okay, sandwich. Yeah, sandwich. What's your favorite rock texture? Yeah, sandwich. You can't answer really sand. Names. A real texture. Yeah, that's, that's what I thought. Oh man, this is like hard, you know? You mean to tell me that in the level you designed for Barrendor, you did not master every single texture name while making that masterpiece of a I, level? I, I don't even know most of the texture names. I I know some of the ones that have been like jokes, like Wood 5. Support 3? <laughs> Sean T. Support 3 is a good texture. Does Support 3 have a bad texture. reputation? No, it better not. It's the best texture. It's a very nice texture, you know. I, I said this some at some point, but it's like it's Support 3. Support 3 is Support 2, but dirtier. So you can use it in more environments, and it, and it's, uh, it works with great border. There we go. When you get the Super Shotgun, oh. it feels so good. I also like Wood 5. Nice That's a texture. good one. Oh shit. Uh oh, he's got you cornered in the kitchen. Quick, grab one of those knives. Oh. I don't like the metal <laughs> textures very much. I don't think they look very nice. I like those. And I hate how in. Just like the, the metal panels. Yeah. Sean 2. Ugh. How do you feel about Sean 2? Shut the f stop. Stop. I think what? it's, it's not good in moderation. First, Sean. Yeah, you can use it under specific like all of the textures are usable somewhere, I'm sure. But not in the nineties style of the entire room is Sean. <laughs> the entire t very tall room is Sean 2. Everything's see, um, chrome. You ever I gotta see that say, video that's the really heavy rain part where of... it glitches out and the guy's just screaming Sean at the top of his lungs for no reason? <laughs> yeah. Jason! <laughs> Sean! Uh. Yeah, that's Sean 2 is like Icarus, where you're in a spaceship and it's just supposed to all be chrome and it's just all Sean 2 and it just looks so Oh, I thought funny. you were going to yeah, say it was like, it was, when, it was when mankind flew too close to the sun. It's, uh, that's what the texture is. That's... In the future, everything is made of chrome, so it, it adds up. I love Icarus. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Icarus I'm not is... that big. I, I don't like the way Icarus, a lot of it looks, but it's a 90s wad. I love it. Like, Icarus Did is it actually come favorites. out in the 90s, or it just has the style of the 90s? I gotta do a video oh. series on Icarus, because it's I like it that much. If I ever finish cool. size. I'm surprised you like it, but I think it's probably good, like, gameplay-wise. I like this room with the crates and the metal thingy separating them. Yeah, there's a ton of cool detail on this map. So I got the blue key. Alright, we're in business. We're in business. Who yawned? Am I not allowed? Who the yeah, fuck? Yeah, who's, no. who's not satisfied with this sh with this fucking gameplay in front of you that you have to fucking yawn? How disrespectful. <laughs> you could always mute your mic and not subject us to your boredom. Yeah. Doesn't mean I'm bored. Just means Think I'm about others next you're, time. We get it. You feel like you're better than us. So you're bored with us all the time. Don't kind of rub it in. It's hard to tell if I'm moving or if that's moving, but I'm moving, right? I think so. You're moving like in oh. a lot of directions. Well, actually, the whole level moves uh, instead <laughs> of the left. <laughs> Wait, you think uh, someone's gonna buy that? That's like that's the shittiest lie I've ever heard you tell. <laughs> I 
That's insulting to my intelligence, even though there isn't very many. How would anyone believe <laughs> that? very thing? many. <laughs> I don't have this like a Ralph line. I don't have very many intelligence. <laughs> like I said. Do you know if you play the I'm entire, learning. Like... <laughs> I think I'm in much... danger. I think playing too much Barandor, experiencing too much Barandor gives you a brain damage, you know? You got Baron brain. All right. Uh, I need a red key. Ooh. This is a cool area. Well, I'm glad you liked my my comment, so thank you. That is a cool area. <laughs> thank you for... Yeah, you know, I... I guess just personally, uh, I I think Zulk, if if he reins some of his maps in a bit, I think they might flow a bit better. And I think visually he's got everything going. He's definitely ambitious and creative. It's just sometimes people don't want to play super long maps most of the time. Give people something. Yeah. Who add. designed the Who designed the memorization game? That you don't actually need to memorize anything because it makes no sense. Yeah, but who designed uh, Valhen? Okay, I don't, uh, I don't know who that is. Oh my god. Was I supposed to do that? Apparently. I wasn't expecting yeah, to fly, we're kind of a... fly across. Oh. Yeah, I would, I would say this. Oh, you can just fly right out of very... the universe, man. Yeah. I would say they're very Agreed. ambitious, but I think. That I think the challenge uh, for for great mappers, too, like a any mapper is like making a huge map and making all of it compelling, as opposed to, you know. Yeah, like not every map has to making... be like a two-hour movie length. Like just twenty-minute game time, oh. game time to me is perfect. What about forty minutes or? Over an I hour? can play longer levels, but it's hard to, you know, keep it keep up. Um, you know, compelling gameplay stuff the whole time. I feel like this map alone my, is going to be the entire length of the other 10 maps I played. My maps uh, yeah. usually end up fairly long, like way longer than they end up like finishing as, but I end up cutting out parts that don't fit the good like gameplay loop. So, because it's it's better to have a shorter map that just plays better. Just the, the new map I'm coming map. out with this Friday has like 170 monsters and um. I think it's constant action. It's kind of pretty oppressive, but there's no like lulls or like you know. Hopefully. You know, I think it can work because I've played the Annie Morta maps, and you know that I like them a lot. And they're, they're, they've got exploration. They're huge. Lots of detail. So, I feel like there are too many dynamic lights. Yeah, no. Uh, there's there's only 1,200. <laughs> yeah, but, if you uh, can run it, it's great. Um, but I'm just saying for a lot of mappers, and I don't I. I thought Zulk was relatively new at mapping, but I, I think it's just hard to, you know, some people can do it, but um, I, the, also this level is like longer than a lot of your anti-mortem maps. I, I do want to point out that lulls in action can be a good thing, because if you play like an hour long map that's constantly like pushing you, uh, that's, that's a turn off for a lot of people. It's good to have a little bit of like... You don't want to have like no enemies or anything, but it's nice to give like breaks that are fairly easy. I guess I'm going down here, I suppose. Like Doom, like yeah, Eternal Doom, where you spend like, you know, no, one hour finding a switch, a then you shoot a guy, then you spend another hour finding a switch, then you no, shoot another guy. No, Eternal I mean Doom is you... all lulls. <laughs> I mean that you have fights that you can kind of relax with before, because. Maps can be really hard the entire way through, but that that can be a yeah. turn off. I mean, and like incidental combat that just kind of like helps you yeah. flow through without being, yeah. But I'm not saying it has to be mind-numbingly boring, but you can make stuff that's easier and doesn't like push someone to their limits. Then it, then there's stuff like Sunlust where there's basically no incidental and it's all lock-in stuff, and that can yeah, be exhausting. I really, but I really a lot of people like, like that, that kind style. of level design. I you know I only. 
play it because it, like uh as one of the doom things i play it's, oh here's a challenge that's a that's a joke right there it's a pretty chunky <laughs> that's toilet a, that toilet is it's an infamous toilet bio take a picture of the toilet <laughs> bio takes pictures of toilets no i don't Wait. you take pictures of the <laughs> Slander. No, you take pictures for the of record. people on no. the toilet. No, I do not take pictures of toilets. <laughs> Filthy lie. I remember a, like a year or so ago, I found a YouTube channel with this guy who literally reviews public toilets. Yeah. <laughs> that would be Timmy Brown. The official surprising. toilet reviewer. I'm surprised yeah, there's what no Timmy like... does it too, but there was another guy I found. <laughs> it's a wide market. He Google reviews of that. You know, one time I was in town and I had to shit really bad and I couldn't find a good toilet. And I always thought, wouldn't it be cool if there was like an app where like, like TripAdvisor, but for toilets? Yeah. And then like, you know, like which toilets are- What if you could be a local guide on Google? That has always been a pet peeve of mine of there never being enough just public toilets. We should develop an app that like reviews toilets. Like people can leave reviews like, don't go to this bathroom, walk farther to that one. It's better. And it'll Clippy's be like the exact hole. opposite of every other review app. The shittier Honestly, the reviews you, are, the better the product to, is. When you have to go, I like I pretty much go in expecting the public toilet to not be in great condition. Because I don't know what it is about people, but when it comes to a public toilet, they seem to think that have have permission to be it just turned into a complete animal. I'm like I'm gonna spit you on the yep. wall for no reason at all. But picture this though: like you're in town and it's like an emergency. Like, oh, I got a shit, and you're like, what am I gonna do? And you pull out your phone, and it goes. You know, there's a four-star toilet yeah. ten meters away, toilet, but there's a five-star toilet. Meters. You know? I, like I said, when I have to go, I don't fucking care. You want to pull your phone and go, where's the best door. bathroom? As long I, as... I long don't as care what the, the rate is. I just need a fucking vase to shit in, you know? <laughs> <laughs> just I need a lawn. Me. I don't give a crap if it's rated you three just, or five stars. You don't give a just crap. tell me where the nearest toilet is. The problem is, you if the app gets too popular, everybody one. goes to the high star ones, and then they're yeah, bad. Yeah, and then and then that degrades the quality. So who cares? If you, you if you go to a the public hush, toilet, hush. Exper exper expecting it to be like uh, pristine and that, like you, then you've never been to a public toilet before in your life. There's some good public no, you gotta, toilets. You, actually. you got to make it a paid program so it keeps the riffraff out. Dude, so there's a Chinese knows. food I'm restaurant around here pain. that has like. Like red walls and like dragons on it and shit, and like this really cool little golden fountain in there. <laughs> shit! <laughs> Three how out of much five. would you pay to poop? Well, how would Sometimes everybody just feel the if Chinese instead food of having just to use the bathroom, man? It's great. How would just everyone feel if instead of leave. having to uh, instead of having to wipe like after you were done, like Jar Jar's head just came out of the toilet and licked your butt clean? How would you feel about that? Oh! Like wow, I only have He's a rock gonna do for you. I literally only have a rock No, no, launcher. don't you worry! I can clean it for you! Jar Jar likes his people matter, as you can see in The Phantom Menace. And 22 I don't minutes remember in, that. he steps in the poopy. Oh, yeah. This is chaos. Whoa. This area is... This is frustrating and, like, tedious. So, this area is hard, uh, and it's hard... It's hard for using, the wrong reason. Using, it's just, like, you have to if meticulously... If you're using auto-aim, if you're using auto-aim and not free look, it's even worse. <laughs> this part is, uh, gonna piss me off, for sure. Yeah, definitely the last map I'm playing. Holy fuck. Down here now. This can't be good. You're and also probably then... like half done. Oh no, don't say that. I do remember <laughs> thinking like, holy crap, this just keeps going uh, <sighs> when Sandwedge was playing it. Like there's no good place to even... Fuck you. Oh, there's... fuck, I missed him. There really is not. I was, I was struggling platforming and shooting and dodging all at the same time. I could at least take one guy out with me. There's All some right. health back there anyway. 
Well, I have enough health for a minute. Another piece of health. Oh. Yeah, there's some nice stuff here. Oh, there's a lot of stuff here. Got him? Fuck you. Yeah. You don't yeah. Make hits immediately. <laughs> Good God, I do not want to hear Sandwich grunting in my ear. Yeah. <laughs> Be your best impression of the Quake guy jumping. Oh, isn't it like? Yeah, like. I like the I like the sound of him jumping. I think Trent Reznor made that sound. <laughs> oh, I actually I think that is Trent Reznor's voice because he did sound uh, that's, right. That's great. Did he? I didn't know he did sounds other sounds though. I actually admire this. Um, oh fuck, going on top of the thing. But it's so like much to take on. Well, I mean, it's good to see, you know, I tested these, but it's, it's interesting to see, you know, oh, this lines up. Yeah. Like I felt this part was a bit too frustrating and kind of seems like, yeah, even with free look, I mean, free look doesn't help a lot because you don't want to, you don't want to fire uh -huh. from below and miss your rockets. I need more shit. Yeah, the items are like placed around, but I'm getting sleepy, but guys, like, I don't know if I can make it. The silent midi. Yeah, so some, you, yeah, you know room. what? This is a long ass map, and sometimes you have to like shoot things one at a time, and it slows you down, but like, the no music thing really does take away from like. Yeah. Like, yeah, it's nothing help. to keep you stimulated and dancing to, you know? I expected like a horror setting when I heard that it had no MIDI. I'm not sure why there's no MIDI in this. Honestly, I don't understand the artistic choice behind that. They, well, I think they wanted kind of a, you know, I'm not sure. They tried to explain <laughs> it and I wasn't really feeling it. I think a couple moments where there's a big, you know, these, these big, huge areas with some grandeur and it's like kind of somewhat eerie but it's not really it, i don't think it carries the level enough i think i think a even a even an ambient thing could do wonders i think it i think the level blows its load early with the uwu cafe um usually like i i feel like for no midi can really work in Doom games, but I mean, you can't really do this in limit removing, but if you have, like, actual ambient noises from, like, sources for, like, computers and stuff like that... Will that, you guys provide uh, ambient noises throughout this video for me? Yeah, no. Here, but that, I got an automatic that, card shuffler shit. for you. That can make a really good substitute for a MIDI. Or not even... You can have both, but... just Yeah, you know, I I don't know if I've even played a level like that, but that would be cool. You should make one for Anti-Mortem. Yeah, I thought about going through the levels again and then adding like uh, noises for the decorations. Of course, you didn't fall stuff. down, you fucker. How I don't think I've ever played a map with the silent MIDI, to be honest. You've played this one. Yeah. <laughs> Other than this one, is what I meant. Yeah, hey, but that's not what you said. I mean, I don't know if I've ever played it where it's like, you know, I, I meant I've never played another one, so I don't know if it can actually work ever. This is crazy I mean, elaborate and cool, sense, though. It's usually, like, a MIDI helps, like, cement, like, a sort of feeling that you get from playing a map. Like, just selling the atmosphere or whatever you're going for. So when you go with nothing, you're not really adding anything to it. Which can work if you're going for, like, an eerie, quiet setting. But I feel like this doesn't line up with that. All right, do I finally get to go up another Baronic space elevator? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, there was one point in the last time in some clippy video where 
or was it during a live stream? I don't know where I said the what's the graph is all more like suck, and I like listened back to it and I realized why the fuck didn't I say crap is all? I just wanted to correct the record here. Take this opportunity. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Oh, I fucking like really starting to hate barons these days. <laughs> well, it's only if you yeah, well, Baron Door, you'll probably hate them as much as I do. It's it's possible that Baron Door will do a lot for the community by making everyone hate barons. <laughs> Never use Nobody's them. Nobody's ever gonna want to play Doom One again. Of all the monsters, by you could have questioned like, couldn't you have wondered if <laughs> it's can open doors or something? It's his fault. <laughs> How is it? What? Why didn't you question Hell Knights, bro? <laughs> it was not my idea to make a fucking mega wad, let alone fucking three <laughs> of them. Get Can't fun. sing your way out of this one, Bio. It says thesis right in the title card. Holy fuck. Lies Are you guys splendor. like fighting over custody of who owns <laughs> Barrendor? Like you both don't want yeah, the kid, but someone has yeah, to have it's it. That's the worst yeah, custody the battle ever. ever. <laughs> Is never my idea. It's the one that Sandwich's parents had. <laughs> I, just... <laughs> Holy shit. I don't want him. So you, you and Sandwich are the maniacs who took my anecdote and thought, let's make it into a mega world. Huh? You get the, you get the swedge. No, you get the swedge. Wait, Bio, <laughs> do your best impression of an American. It's so uh, fucking much. Barrendor map. I'd only be able to do like a like a fucking redneck or something. I said just do whatever you think is your best impression possible. I want to hear it. Give it is one of them that they are shitty boys, ain't you? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I mean, you know, you know Hugh Laurie, but. Yeah, I've still from? got Baron Door recorded stuff that I never. <laughs> yeah, we'll come back now, you hear? Nah, you let me up here now, you did, 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 did. If your fishing lures can double for earrings, you might be a redneck. You might be a redneck <laughs> if you go to a family reunion look for a date. Wait, wait, this is important. You know those, like, fish things that are out they use as, like, a lure? It's like a. It's like a gummy looking thing. Uh -huh. Oh, okay, yeah. Jig? I used to... I used to... chew those. <laughs> I'd... Are you a fish? <laughs> yeah. No, I'm not, I'm not oh. kidding. I would actually, like, see this worm. This, like, gummy like worm. With the, with like, the, with the hook still in it? Sometimes. You are my favorite weirdo on the internet, I swear. <laughs> no, I, I just... I never, like... I didn't... Usually swallow it. Sometimes a few pieces. No, when no, I'm my I, throat, usually, like... I, under, I understand you just gnawed on it because you wanted yeah, to. Yeah, I'm like this thing looks like a gummy worm. You have an oral fixation. No, I have swallowed three marbles in my lifetime. Oh my fucking god! What happened? Did they come out the other end? So how did that or... leave you? No, I never saw them again. So like. What are marbles made out of? Is that at like how to digest the At this point, I'd that. be surprised if there was something you didn't sniff or snort or smoke or swallow or whatever snacks like. <laughs> the list just keeps getting bigger. Yeah, I've I've snorted flour and sugar off of shopping carts. I've <laughs> I've snorted so sugar. Strange. I've just snorted some. Kool-Aid one time. I, no, not Kool-Aid. What? Is, uh, iced tea crystals. <laughs> like, you guys have no sense of self-preservation. Like, oh, this might be bad for my lungs. Now, that thought does not occur. You just, hey, I'm just gonna no, snort no, it. No, no, it's not, not. It's not bad for your lungs. It's bad for the lining for your nostrils. Someone jib that toilet up bad. Like, I did a little reading. I would really. On yeah, the left. Just for your health snacks, please stop crushing up your pills and snorting them. Someone <laughs> jibbed up that it's toilet, really bro. <laughs> that is not a five star. <laughs> it's yeah. not a five star watch. You should get a one one star on the app. That's a one star. Yo, I went into this hotel washroom and there was a fucking jibbed corpse in there. <laughs> not going back there. 
That's like a Baron took a shit after eating a Doom guy. I like. Uh, you guys remember Bean, the old Bean Factory one where like the you go into yeah. an office and then, a, and then a Baron comes factory? out of the toilet. No, old Bean Factory. Yeah. Okay. I thought... I heard yeah, anal there's, a bar there's an the award-winning walk. Then you hear a flush. You turn around, the door opens, and a baron walks out, and you kill him. And he, yeah. realizes, he didn't even use the toilet. He's, there's a turd on the floor. <laughs> Thank God, he's, I like this, this. He's, he's kind of like the CEO too. He's like yeah, in that what nice is the room. CEO of the demonic bean factory. That level is so good, dude. I know it's so cute and funny. I love it. It's what adorable. What did I just get myself into here? Like, I, I, oh, I'm looking forward to whatever KWC makes, man. Yeah. I, I, I can't wait. That was like a, um, you know, like a Doom Cute Bonanza, and like, it, it's not like mind blowing, but it's just so wholesome and en enduring and, and cheeky. Like, it's got a fun, it's got a good sense of humor to it. I just really enjoyed that map. The Seinfeld secret. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I found that. I don't remember. Yeah, I didn't. I actually asked him about it because, like, I couldn't find it. Yeah, it's pretty good. I'm gonna have to replay it. I've only played it once. Cause I know Matt Payne reviewed it, so everybody was talking about it again. Yeah, I mean, it deserves to be talked about. It's I'll great. Play it I love cool. it. All the textures and stuff. It's it's it def it feels like a build engine level with all the detail in it. I actually uh, I don't did you he was working on. Uh, one that was like sort of inside a computer, which was really cool. I tested, a, I only tested like, I think it was one level, one or two levels for that. But they look like they have a lot of work put into them, so take a while. Man, I need. <laughs> <laughs> I should totally like if I was gonna do like if I was gonna bother with a speed run, I might start with old Bean Factory. <laughs> I would grind that level. Well, we're down to our last hundred and some. I, f I totally forgot this room existed in this wall. This this is so long. It was a it was a rather girthy level. A what? A horsey level. Girthy. Derpy? It's got girth. Girthy. Oh, girthy. Where am I going? You need the yellow key to activate this object. <laughs> yes, that's How do I get? Taller. How do I get to the next? Oh, there's some more stairs. Okay. 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 Wow, this isn't tedious at all. And the, it, 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 it's there. so much worse with no noises, no musics. <laughs> I know. Like, at least when I'm running around the stairs for a night, you can be like, doop, 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 you know, some kind of music, you know? Yeah, this level doesn't yeah, have very many. I mean... Why are you pointing back you the way I came? Drop a midi in there. <laughs> Maybe it's those vents, the vent panels. That might be something, I don't know. So you're right, right there. No? Wow. <laughs> I need to put on some music myself. Man, this map is so crazy elaborate, but there's no, like, doors being pegged. Unless that's an artistic choice. Yeah, I noticed that when Sandwich <laughs> played. It was rather... Are, are doors into that sort of thing? I don't even remember where the yellow key door is. Maybe it's in the right. room. In my head, my the music for this level is now Lamb of God. What the hell is that? Band. I bet they suck. <laughs> they sort of do, actually, but I like the drumming. I listen to them for the drumming, I swear. Is that how you have to explain it to your parents? <laughs> then when you explain the multiple pornography free magazines you have, because you read them for the articles, you swear? I read them for the articles. <laughs> okay. I listened to they had them a great the article drumming. on Marshall McLuhan. Who the hell is that? <laughs> I don't know. 
Who the hell is that? Some guy. I wasn't making a joke. I don't know who that is. Uh, Some intellectual like, he, he, on yeah, media he, studies. He, he was an academic, like in in regards to like media and that. Like he's behind the quote: "the the medium is the message." Yeah, and the global village. Wait, isn't that guy Canadian? Concept. He was in one of those, you know, yeah. Canadian. He's at U of T. Yeah, he's like he's like one of the most important Canadians of like sort of. Yeah, because I remember those before. heritage moments. You guys remember those? They have these little like, historical like clips of like things that are important to our history. Yeah, like, I had I had to learn a bit about McLaren's theory and bullshit in my like animation degree. So. Yeah, it's kind of the thing that you always get in liberal arts. That yeah. I don't know. To be honest, the Playboy interview with him is actually like one of the clearest interviews with him, which is why I, I wasn't joking that I read a Playboy article for school. Can you guys fuck off? Sorry. Rude. Like the Barons. Obviously, well, no, Barons. You're fine Barons. These guys hasn't triggered the final fight. Hey, wait, didn't the city of Halifax once just, like, fucking explode or something? The train had explosives on it and they blew up, yeah. There was a boat during the, cool. the First World War that exploded. Uh, was that Halifax or was that elsewhere? Yeah, that tends to happen in wars. Uh, <laughs> well, it wasn't in enemy territory. It just fucking crashed or something and exploded and leveled an entire town. I don't think uh, ships have to be in enemy territory to get blown up, but... I... You, you, you don't really want them blowing up where you're making them. <laughs> Why? Uh, it doesn't go well. Fuck, it's late. G, F, F2 or F U? F2. F3. Oh, those are teleports that go back to those floors. Oh, floor one, floor two, floor three, and then the ground floor. I get it. That's pretty cool if you want to go back. explosion. Oh. Yeah. Cool. Well, yeah, wasn't that like, how far? Was... Okay, we're at the final fight, aren't we? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, this is Circle Straight the Encounter, as Dan Wedge described it. Oh, save that. Don't have oh, there, was don't a know, fire that board, there was a fire aboard the ship next to Halifax, and it... Uh... And the guy on the train was a hero because yeah. he stopped everybody from... He, you know, he got everybody out of there. It's on a ship. No, I'm talking about the train. No, there was a train explosion. I get trains and ships confused. You're talking about the most I'm recent looking... one? Like no, I'm Megan talking about T the one from, like, forever ago. Back in 1972, there was a boat that hit another boat in Halifax, and it exploded and leveled the whole city. Oh, no, it's it was 1917. a boat. The guy had the telegram. 19... He was clicking the thing. 17. Did I this? say 1972 or did I say 1917? Which one did I say? 1972. Oh, I was not ready okay, for that. It was that. 1917. I don't know why yeah. I said 72. That's when we were actually making shells in huge quantities. Back when Canada actually did things. <laughs> we fought in the Second World War too. <laughs> yeah, and then what? <laughs> On. Uh, did some stuff. We haven't started a lot of wars, though. You know, uh, the, the treaty that they signed to agree, yes, we will drop the bombs on Japan, they signed that in Canada. <laughs> wow. Congratulations, that's your place in history. Yeah, we probably had a lot of control over that, I'm sure. <laughs> you're just, you're a footnote on that. Canada was okay with it. So you should be too.
I'm gonna I'm gonna press you on what you personally did. I know you were piloting the Enola Gay sandwich. I know it was you. You were wearing a cowboy hat, and you rode it down there personally. You might be mixing up a couple of things. I don't think I am. I know exactly <laughs> what I'm talking about. I'll get sick. Are you looking at Wikipedia right now? No, I just, I happen to know that because the girl I dated in high school had the same birthday. Oh, that's great. Yeah, she was like 80 by the time I met her, but... So how do we plan this one out with just enough, just the right amount of stuff you need? It's not like a certain other map where it's just... We have so many resources that we need more enemies to compensate. This one, I think I'm just gonna have enough. Well, at least there's that. You'd think with a cafe on one of the floors, they wouldn't be so thirsty. Holy shit. Okay, now I gotta press a bunch of buttons and hopefully we're done. Are we gonna be done? How do you know they're drinking Thanks. water? I, I, yeah, they could be I, drinking I, gamer piss. I didn't say they were drinking water. I'm saying they could get a drink there or something. No, but I'm, I'm implying that the cafe doesn't sell water. Duh. Oh no, there's yeah, no elevator. Yeah, sells water. Unless it's in a bottle, I guess they sell it. Who the it, fuck but... goes to fucking, like, Starbucks? Oh, we like, did it! Can I get an ice water? What are you, a duck? Wait. I remember a, a friend of mine went on a date to a coffee shop and he walked in there with the girl and they didn't, neither of them bought anything, they just sat at a table and talked for like an hour and then left. Oh. Wow. Affordable. Yeah. Well, I'm done. Sure is. <laughs> Are you done? Are you done done? I'm so done. Oh, thanks for coming with me I on this, I probably would have uh... recommended you not start this. I probably would have kept this to its own episode. But, hey, oh, I here didn't we know. are. Alright, we'll do more Baron Door some other time. But thanks for coming with me on this uh, interesting journey through, you know, Biodegradable's community project there. Yeah, <laughs> thanks, Bio. Alright. <laughs> Three cheers for Bio! Hip, 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 hip. hooray! Hooray! <laughs> That's the video. Or he's a jolly good rogue.